would be nice if I turned my milk on. Hello, everyone. I hope everyone is doing well. Just taking my work boots off. Let me just uh, throw up some Discord notifications. String friends, there we go. Okay. So we're going to be trying to get to the first DLC Rings of Fire, I believe. Because I need to get to some of the mounts that Cynthia has. So that we can actually do things together properly.
Have you fought these things before? How do you kill the undead? Fire, decapitation, spellcraft. Okay. Whatever kills the living, kills the walking dead. Oh, that sounds easy. I just hope we survive the trip there. <laughs> Are you well? Remain strong. Okay, why can't you speak to me properly? For too long, Tyria has suffered. We gather now with newfound purpose. Zaitan's servants storm our homelands. It is time to bring the battle back to Or. This tide will wash over Ara and cleanse the dragon's corruption. Together, we will prevail. Let the ship sail. Let the troops march. And let us find victory! A stirring Whoa! speech to her. <laughs> Absolutely. You've turned into a real war leader, Marshal. Now if we can just keep the impetus you started, then we'll have a chance. Thank you, friends. May fortune bless you. Huh. Good to see you. Let's get this briefing underway. Commander, I wanted to follow up with you about the Siska incident. I've made my share of mistakes, even without mesmer trickery. Some things cannot be undone, but they can be mitigated. Warmaster Kason has been fully briefed and her entire unit is aware of how you are all misled. That won't bring back their comrades, but knowing the truly guilty party was punished does soften the blow. There's someone I'd like you to meet. Our visitor may cause alarm, so privacy is paramount. Sire, it's now safe to reveal yourself. Greetings, Marshal Traherne. As you've requested, I've come to honor my oath. Excellent. Let's speak with the commander and give you an assignment. What's on your mind? Thank you for your patience, Commander. Allow me to introduce the revered Sire Al-Rajid. In the name of the Concordat of the Tetyos Houses, I greet you, ally of my ally. It's an honor, Sire. I've heard that your people don't meet with land dwellers. You speak truth. I have long owed Treven. Now at last he has called upon me to honor my oath. Scouts have discovered a sixth temple in Or. A lost shrine to a fallen god, hidden underwater in the Strait of Malediction. Abaddon, the human god of secrets, was cast out of Ara by the other deities, and his name was erased from history. Very little remained. Zaitan craves something inside that temple, so we must get there first. Sire will accompany you as a guide. Tell me, Commander, can you fight? Is your oath made of steel? You'll need all your skills to travel with me. I have yet to meet anything I couldn't overcome. Intriguing. 
I look forward to this, Commander. Until then, may your steps be relentless. Thank you. Okay. Metro uh, uh, take. Hoping your good fortune continues. All right, let's free up this. And there's nothing here. If the pact isn't in control of the candidate, we'll never launch our northern assault. Guard the shoreline. Getting healthy.
Another place to roam. Good morning, aviators. This is your captain speaking. How are you?
what you up to, I'm not. This is not getting my missions done. We'll prevail. I will resist you. Right fucking here. Jesus. Trying to finish my school. Nothing much. How about you? Uh, trying to get to the point to where I can. Um, I am here, Commander. Get Let us uh, discuss some more mounts. So that Cynthia and I can game on the same level. In the name of the Concordat, I greet you, Commander. The way ahead is dark and uncompromising. Exactly what I'd expect from the ancient temple of a dead god. Yes, of course. The Risen have already bypassed the wards and breached the temple. We must exterminate them. Be warned. There are dangers here not of the dragon. Powers ancient and unseen still occupy these halls. Leave me, Reaver. I will follow.
monsters that are risen. You should test such a theory with that essence. See if it can be placed somewhere useful. Look, the currents shift. The ocean's flow changes. These shrines and orbs must be how we gain entry.
view. of nightmares, huh? Excellent progress. Thank you. Oh, 
Sama. Two shrines. We must be close to the altar of secrets. The center of them. should be in the next chamber. Be cautious. Something's wrong. We must be swift. on the dragon's lands. You too will serve Zaitan. No, slave creature. We serve our oaths, and those oaths demand your death. So be it. To death and beyond. Will not withstand the sound. It's we are buried forever.
Did I just fuck everything up? I did. Oh, nope, I had to go here. Well fought and well won. Most impressive, my ally. It was victory, but we still lost the artifact. True, but we've made a dragon no fear. That commander is a victory to relish. Maybe we can still salvage this. What do you know about the creature we faced? I do not know for certain. What is certain is that you've just encountered two of Zaitan's most powerful servants. ...and that they escaped your grasp. Not for long. I'm reporting to Treherne right away. We'll see if we can't organize a pursuit. I will also carry this news when I return to be freed from my oath. May your steps be relentless, Hunter. Be relentless, Commander. I shall carry word to the... Hello. Hello. Hi. Yeah, my uh, game audio shouldn't be coming in, so it's all on my headset. I like the girl's hair. You can't have one and not the other. You can't have one and not the other. And then I, I do kind of get his argument about how gay people have the lived experiences and X, Y, Z, but acting is a fan. I just turned the video. For an actor, think about this. If an actor, um, Tom Hanks, was played uh, in Saving Private Ryan, yes. but he doesn't have uh, Second World War uh, experience. So, so what? So you will 
hire only actors who had second world war experience for that for that role that make no sense for me yeah it makes no sense because most of them are dead anyways you know. at, 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 yeah but i mean i, I just mean, wanted to come up with, with, with an example that you don't have to have for a gay role a, a gay actor you don't have to have for a straight role a straight actor yeah. or a, a a war zone story you, you don't need soldiers for those you can learn from them of course you you can you can uh, learn and and uh, hone your skills to repre to represent much better that that person that you are playing in the movie that's that's cool that's why you are an actor you you able to learn it but you don't have to have any kind of lived experience for that you just have to have the skill to represent it to, to represent it in the movie make sense well, it's just like me i'm a reenactor i know nothing about the wars of I was never born during those wars, I should say. But yeah. I study. It's the yeah, same you, thing. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's, it's the same thing. It's the same thing. Yeah. It's like if the requirement for a reenactor to be in some kind of a war which you are reenacted, that would make no sense. Yeah. In my opinion, that, that makes sense in so, everybody's but, opinion with that. I, I'm just saying this because what he's saying makes no sense for me, but maybe I'm wrong. Uh, and that's no, why I'm not. I was listening, and it's like, yeah, that makes no sense. Okay, let's continue with the video. Sana? No, I'm sorry. Absolutely okay. <laughs> Okay, that's a good example as well. Because if that's the logic, if we if we should only have characters playing other characters that are the same sex on that got a bit of a head structure. So if you take Rock Capital, for all intents and purposes, at the beginning, yeah. those two main characters are straight men in the line, right? Beaming these people. Again, for all intents and purposes, get straight men. So while they are the straight men, they're currently being played by straight men. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, the two yeah, yeah, do it. I can yeah. see where you're going now. Yeah. yeah. However, they start to go on fishing trips together and they end up falling in love. Yeah. Actually, and the gay now. The party yeah. gay now, right? When their sexuality changes, should the actors change? Absolutely. Giving up the slip out. Can you imagine? It's a different guy. This is, this is what I mean, though. Is if people only want gay people playing gay characters, how do you, how do you navigate they somebody? Gay men tending to. But then you've got a gay oh person. My gosh, my brain. Yeah. You've got a gay person acting yeah, straight, it, it. and then and then it's the opposite, isn't it? it it's... And then you've also got the thing yeah. like when you look at Neil Patrick Harris, there's so many gay men who play straight incredibly well, but I think because they're right for the part, and then also you've got to look at things like the name, the like the name to find a target that role. Yeah. I still want to see that movie, The Danish Girl. Me neither. I want to see it. Why, why do you say me neither? One second. I want to see it. There you go. There is, there is a... Right now you have a good um, family movie night for everyone. No, I, prob I probably watch it alone. Uh, as you wish. The, 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 we don't have family. Oh, Junior is too, too, uh, too young to understand. Oh yeah, you were right about that. Yeah, and I don't watch movies with Lisa. Oh, uh, I, I would say in that case, don't watch this movie with Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it, it will be maybe too much for her. But you can always ask, like nobody, off. nobody was hurt by by a question. Yeah, as like me, well, I like movies, watch, like watch movies, 
if it doesn't get me within the first five minutes. Uh, I don't know. I like to watch first uh, the trailer of the movie. Yeah. And if it was capturing me, just the trailer, then I, then I'm interested. By the way, Same just way. to let you know, guys, I I am really uh, how can I say? Uh, I am I have a great delay with movies, because the last movie when I when I watched it was in 2018. That's you know I can understand that because the last movie that I watched, which was new, was back when back in 08. It's nothing like I'm bragging about. I'm just not not fancy any Hollywood movies nowadays. Yeah, yeah. I nowadays, for the last uh, I don't know uh, five five six years. I watched some Star Wars, and they, those were disappointing. Yeah, the new Star Wars are oh. disappointing. <laughs> yeah. You see, I, I can't even tell if it's disappointing or not, because I haven't watched any of those. Some oh. of the Star Wars, yes, the old ones, yes, yeah. but the new ones, oh... Well, it this could, year... it could be anything. Let me just say, Cynthia, you're not missing much, okay? No. Okay, that's fine. The, the that's Disney fine. ones aren't the worst. What, what I stopped really watching is Disney movies. Like the old ones I like. Yeah, the new ones? But oh my goodness. Okay. Let, let's continue. When you have a when you think you can draw a and that's when you get trouble with the and get a bit of 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 the everything they have expectations of favors something like the lord of the rings by the rings things like that they're not going to put a no name actor in the lead role no but always put someone who you never yeah what's a good point Films. I don't know if you've seen it. TV show, of course, it's yeah. It's incredible. It's like the biggest trans cast that there is, and there's so many trans women in it, and it's beautiful. And maybe they brought some dimensions to the world. Well, yeah, but again, it's set what the 80s. Yeah, it's yeah. <laughs> holding it. Trans women in that show, and old enough to remember being like in the 20s and 80s. It's obviously it's still years apart. So they're acting about living through the HIV and AIDS crisis. They didn't really live that. They no. learned about that through school and life and everything. But they play that amazing in that other stage acting. Mm -hmm. So yes, them being trans in it was great, and I love that aspect. But they are again, they're just playing the character. Yeah. I, I don't believe if you have two actors, one's gay, one's straight, they're both 30 years old and they're both going for an audition to play a gay man in the 80s, yeah. 70 80s, during the AIDS epidemic. I don't believe automatically the gay actor should get the role because no. he's gay. And, and yes, he did the one would say... The best. Yeah, exactly. But, you know, just because he's gay doesn't automatically give him more experience with that role. It's like you just mentioned about, about the age thing. He's the, you know, if, he, if he's 35, He's not old enough to have lived through that stage That's the of a yeah. gay person's yeah. experience. So, yes, he's gay, but he's not that Like that guy on the Vietnam movie, he's talking about when something came out, and he was crazy, 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 and he was craz
Yeah, yeah. they brought their rise to where they were. I can see where it's coming from. It was. Right. It, you I, watch I the see, movie. I, don't think, I think it's enorme. Like how they. It's really sad mm. that the it's not awful. Yeah. And it's the end of his life, Nick. So tragic. Like the main part of the movie is the rise of Queen and where they came from. Living, living, celebrating. Living. But whether or not they did, I didn't stick over it. You can agree that it's not in his hands. No, he's just no, he's, not he's an actor. He's he's not really not to say. You know, and that's down to the that's down to the studio. Can I give you some statistics? Because yeah. I put out some polls on Instagram because I was really interested in what other people that we what you guys thought because I was under the illusion that we were going to get one answer, and the answer that we got was the opposite, which we really <coughs> really yeah, where you thought was it high was low. Really. Basically, yeah, you. Yeah. So, with the statistic that I have, so I asked on Instagram, should straight actors play gay characters? Yes. So, okay. 81% of people said yes, which surprised me. Well, that's still 19% that said no. I know, which is fair enough. Everyone's valid to the opinion, obviously. But I thought I was going to be so the way. I thought Mark Eaton would say, no, straight people should not be playing gay characters. And I also asked, should only trans people play trans characters? And this one was more closer, if that makes sense. Excuse so, me, friends, but I must speak with the commander. 32% of people said yes, I shall send only for the trans rest of people you soon. should play trans mm -hmm. characters. And 68% said no, you don't have to be trans hey, to play hey. trans characters. It's a little bit closer, but still, I agree. I don't think you should be trans to play trans characters, or you should be gay to play gay characters, and so on and so on. But it surprised me, because I thought more people would be inclined to say you have to begin thinking. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I know what I'm I don't know why I thought that in my head. I just, it's like my presumption, I guess. And I was wrong, so that's what I think. Assumption? That's my assumption. 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 Yeah. Assumption. 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 I don't know. I'm really interested. What do you guys think? Do you think that you should be getting to play a gay role? Do you think that it will change how you play the role? Do you think that it would be better if they were gay playing gay role? And same for trans role. Let us know. There's always this, would it be better? I think it's different. Yeah. Once again? If a gay person plays a gay role, yeah, there might be some things a little bit different from a st how a straight people would do it, but would it be better? I don't know. I don't know if it would be better, because everybody uh, uh, lays their focus on our priorities, on different things, and I hate it when it's, some things are just not worth making a competition. Like music, this is the best music, or this is the, no, some things are just not worth making a competition. Ah, I think so not worth to compare to each other. Yeah, because okay. I think a gay person would maybe always achieving uh, do some things more accurate, but doing it too accurate might not make it appealing enough. So maybe it's better in some ways that the straight person does, it because maybe they make it more appealing for the broader audience, because the the most people uh, identify as straight. And not just that, uh, I would add that when you are on a, a painter and you want to paint uh, somebody's um, feeling, like in a picture, you, you try to paint it, that picture. Or, for yeah. example, you are taking a picture from from nature and you I want the, the viewer to feel the same as you were feeling and seeing when you were there. But the picture itself that uh, uh, he was taking is not the same. It's not giving back the feeling. So he has to manipulate somehow the photo to make it uh, in a way uh, to reflect that emotion and experience that he was having when, when he was standing there. Yeah. So in that case, you really don't have to have a gay person for a gay role. You need a really talented uh, anybody, an actor, yeah. to play that role. I, I like because the, that, that this, actor. I like this explanation. I like right? It. Yeah. So I'm, I'm coming back to this explanation when when I want to describe that 
you, as you said, and you were giving me uh, the idea that you want to represent that that role, and it's the same when when uh, when a photographer want to uh, want to show you the same emotions and feelings that he was feeling when he was standing there, but the picture cannot cannot give it back in the same way because he was making a picture, yes, but the lights are not the same. Uh, the colors are not so colorful, f like for your eyes. No, he has to change the picture. He has to manipulate the picture. He has to enhance different uh, aspects of the uh, of the picture. Maybe cut out something. Maybe add more something, just to make it sure that that picture that we'll show to you will uh, produce the same emotion that he felt when he was making that picture. I think that that is in itself art. Yes, I agree with that. Yeah, and sometimes it's also I don't know if this adds a really good point to the story, but uh, if if you listen to music and you listen live, it will also it's impossible to add the feeling of the live music to the studio music. So when a studio artist also they enhance it, but yeah, in a, in a different way. And uh, sometimes it's a bit, a little bit too perfect, if you ask me. But yeah, you got to do something to uh, make it be able to and yeah, not compete, but uh, represent the live version. A fitting reward. I or, think we are agree on this. Yes, I think we all agree. Yeah, it, it's, a li it's a little bit the same story, but it's also... Yeah, the, 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 I think also with the photo it will be more than perfect. It, it has a little addition to it. The, the personal touch maybe which you're describing. Uh, for the, about, because you want the feeling, so... Yeah. Maybe. All right, let's finish the video. <laughs> yes. No oh, question and answer. Let's see what what people were asking them. Gorgeous. Some of the, the buildings are cool things there. Yeah. That's the foundation. I yeah. talked to you in Yorkin. You did. You were in Tanuri there as well. Yeah. And we were in there last week. We love it. We love it. Yeah. 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 Right, Christmas 3. Where's your brain? It's from Diana Robbie57. 
And they say, have you funds for children? I think you would make awesome. Thank you. Thank we you. kind of have a plan. Mm. Like, we both want kids, we both want kids to them, I've always wanted kids, I want to be able to call to say. Obviously, biologically, it's not going to happen. No, no it's good. You leave very good at that. Well, adopt, that is probably you know, you're not getting that. I don't think you're getting that, right? No, we haven't heard of a time frame, but we have a certain amount of time frame. We have a certain amount of time frame. We have a certain amount of time frame. We have a certain amount of time if money was no object, like make no mistake, if money, if, if, if I won the lottery tomorrow, I would literally... No guys, winning the lottery is not good. A constant income is good. <laughs> How enthusiastic he is! <laughs> but, uh, I gotta go sleep though in a minute. Like a super? Yeah, me? Uh, Daniel? Uh, I was speaking on my stream. Okay. I was saying, oh, thank you so much for, uh, listening. Oh, okay. Hold on. Right. Great stream as always. <laughs> good, good. Getting healthy. Yeah, I think we fall. That's not the middle, is it? Three. That's a 2.5. Well, that's the average, isn't it? Uh, Two. But yeah, no, absolutely one case. Obviously, because we have to adopt, it's not just uh, an easy... It takes like a year off, so we probably need to add... Yeah, it's only... Yeah, which right is so, which makes sure they yeah. the best Yeah, I, I agree, it's right, but for them to do that. But on the other side of it, it's a woman that are together, which is Yeah, I got to go. Right, tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow it's six thirty again. Let me just share the link. Oh, it was fun discussing the the, 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 the video. It's 20 seconds from the video. If you do like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. And we will see you guys in the next one. It's so smooth. Well done, baby. They are truly a power couple. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Sana, you don't know the news. Fuck. I don't know the news. Yeah, I, I will share the news with you. Oh. My my surgery for uh, the thorax the is delayed. Landing, no. Yeah. yeah, I I got the information and the letter today. Another land. Why? Uh, because I blame myself. <laughs> I I should have called them earlier. I should have write them earlier. Because the blood bank just doesn't care, the and this. Uh, this I just guess now because I don't have any information that uh, We're ready to begin, Commander. Our scouts they took my brother on January the 25th courtyard. and now they said that we have to wait like how long? Old friends of yours, I believe. Most of the time two weeks here. would be okay you but now join the fight it's, the for them it's not enough. Now we can repay you so for instead of you. having my surgery on the 7th we need to spread out of and move quickly, but keep each other March in sight. I don't want it will be what is on the doing here? Wait a second. Second of April. 
So it's like a out of season April, uh, April's Fool's joke. No more, please. So if you it's think not, about it. So it's another month. Yes, yes. Yeah. It's quite long, but also, yeah, at least it's still in the in the running. Yeah, still soon. Uh, it's still soon. Still soon. True. True. It's still soon. Holy shit! I, I I don't want them to wait another whole year. That 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 was already enough. Um, what I know that on the twenty, what I was writing on Discord. Let me see my Discord message. What was the date? Twenty first of March. So, from <laughs> one month from now, I have to go in. And uh, they will do some before the surgery examination, yeah, yeah. which I don't know what. Some EKG things like this, Double something like that. That's the same gas to knock you out, stuff like that. The usual no, stuff. They don't. They don't do anything uh, anest anesthetic at that time. Oh really? I mean. On the 21st, I'm going in for some kind of an examination. I, I send a, a question that how long does this examination took? Like, do I have to stay there? How many hours? Lie. Like, Caesar. my first time Caesar in the blood bank, mind. I was Into there like dream. three hours, four There's hours. No and then the this examination we really took, I don't know how much you. time. I don't know how much day, frankly. I don't know. Looks looks and I, I have no idea what they want to check. We can still save her. We can take her back to Fort Trinity as soon as our mission and is complete. And then when it's done, I guess I will go home because why would I stay from the twenty-first uh, in the hospital from March twenty-first up until yeah, and and the surgery will be in two weeks. So twenty-first will be uh, a, a Thursday. And then after 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and after that 12 days, uh, that will be my surgery day. But I have to go in, I guess, the, the previous day, uh, just to get prepared. I guess so. I, I send a question as well. So basically, Cynthia, uh, that day, they're going to go over all the pre-op stuff. To make me feel a little more at ease, they always do that. Uh, what, 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 what is that going through the, the pre-op stuff? What is that? Uh, on, let me... Um, okay, I'm safe right here. Uh, the pre-op stuff, they're going to talk about the messaging gas. Go through all your blood work, your EKG, like you were saying. And then answering any questions you may have. The surgeons will talk to you. They'll tell you how they're going to proceed what to do if they're gonna tell you what to do what they're gonna do if there is any kind of um situation where it's not gonna go normal it's just all the stuff they have to do to tell you okay so i'm not really worried now because uh my my uh, blood draw is going well yeah so i don't think that uh uh, blood loss will be a problem at no. all for my no. surgery. And that that they're going to tell you, be... you know, the possibility of you not waking up from an necessine gas is less than 5%. Um, but they're good at what they do, so you don't have to worry about that. They're just going to tell what you I do everything. What I don't want to get is this uh, epidural um, pain relief. I don't want them to uh, put any kind of epidural in my in my spine. And that's when you tell them that. And you, they'll probably ask questions about your um, blood mutation. Things that they that need to look a, out. It's like, what, what can I say? I have it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What else can I say? It's I have it, but it's not causing me any problem. 
and they'll ask you, you know, have you had any pain in the last 30 days? Have you gotten injured? Have you got COVID? Stuff like that. I never got COVID. And I, the last time I was sick, it was because of two months of constant sleep deprivation mm -hmm. and exhaustion. And that was last year when I was uh, quitting my job. I was quitting my job because I was so sick yeah. already. And you don't have to tell them that because it's already, you know, they'll ask you six months out, you know, six months ago. Have you it was sick? last year. Yeah. I mean, it, it was 12 Another months ago, so it is legend. already out of the question if, if that would be a problem. And since that, I, I wasn't even uh, sick at all. I mean, with nothing. And they'll ask you, are you allergic to any kind of medication so that they don't give you the wrong Most medication. likely. Most likely. And uh, that is uh, uh, antibiotics. My father is is uh, allergic to antibiotics, especially for penicillin. And when I was a kid, I was also really sensitive to that. So it is likely that uh, antibiotics would kill me as and well. Make sure you tell them that. <laughs> I already told them, but I will tell them again. Yeah, they're going to ask you all these questions, even though it's on their chart. They want to make sure that you know. This is kind of stupid because it's already yeah, on your indeed. chart that you know why you asking these questions. I already told my, my first uh, surgeon, the first doctor I was talking with, that if it's possible, I don't even want to get any kind of antibiotics. He said that, oh no, that's not possible because uh, we will be opening up your inside cavities. Okay, so what is the minimum? Up, 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 up. He wasn't. Got, uh, he he didn't have any kind of answer. So I said, okay, then I, I would like to go with the, the the bare minimum antibiotics, and I need somebody to monitor my my uh, system because that could kill me. Because if it, if it would kill me, they have to stop the antibiotic. Yeah, and they just have to uh, concentrate on working on me in a ster uh, sterile way. Yep. Like everything has to be. Uh, sterile uh, uh, around me, and that's it. And they'll go we'll and speak tell into the you wound. how they're going to proceed, how to cut cut you open, how to stitch you back up. It's just actually, know. I have I have questions about uh, the procedure, like how much uh, muscle they want to cut yeah. uh, in the front of my chest, and because as, I, I'm doing now. I'm doing now really heavy lifting, and my core muscles, if they cut through. How much will be the damage? It, will, will it ever heal, for example? These are questions that I want to have because I have a well-developed uh, frontal... My abs are really good. Uh, it's just not visible because I have fat on them, but it's really good, really strong. And, and I'm... Where? On my belly. On my belly, on my thighs, and on my, on my ass. Where? These are the I don't points. see you, and I'm being honest with you. This door will be a because I'm sitting now, it, it, it's here. <laughs> it's on me, don't worry. It's not going anywhere, that's the problem. <laughs> anyway, uh, because they make a cut in the, in the center, because that's how they will pull out um, the thorax itself. And then on the two sides, they put inside the bars. I guess they, they use two bars, I, I guess. They will show you the bars as well. They'll show you everything oh, that oh. they're going to put inside there. My, my other question would be, how would they uh, uh, fasten it uh, to my ribs? Yep. Like, yep. would they use um, some kind of uh, wiring? If that wiring will be... Uh, how they treat the ends of the wires, if it's wires, if it's not wires, what type of uh, fastenings uh, will they use, how flexible uh, will it be, how, what shall I expect, like, if they leave anything sharp in my body, that would be a problem. Yeah. And then they'll tell that you would be my question. How long to wait before you start training? Oh, that's six months. I already know, I was reading through the 
the palm, uh, the pamphlet that they uh, send me. Guys, guys, I'm Alright, good night. Good night, Anna. Thank you for joining in. Good night. Right to hear from you. And, uh, I, I know it's still, still April, but I already wish you good luck with it. And Thank you. I know she's going to have good luck. I know. I know it. Yeah, it, uh, probably it's gonna be a professional and it will be going very well. Yeah. No, it, it, it will be professional because I'm a pain in the ass. <laughs> they, they, they want me out there with will, 100%. Exactly. So everything will be fine. Okay. Bye. Good night. Good night. Oh, this is. These are the things that uh, is on my mind right now, especially because I, I received this today. Um, if I don't have the answers, I'll find the answers for Right now, for my question, the answer uh, would would come from the surgeon because he he, he is the he is the person who. Who will give me the proper answer because well he's done, the one who is doing it. Yeah. Now we have something for the researchers back at Fort Trinity to study. But even this mm. eye's um, corpse should tell us more I about Zaitan's servants and how he communicates mouth. with them. I then the risk is worth the, the reward. Stuff, if we learn how Zaitan controls his minions, we can disrupt that control to our advantage. Let's take it back to Fort Trinity and that poor woman too. She needs all the help we can provide. I had assigned to let them actually do the operation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Interesting. That's just I like the it. normal stuff that you always worry about in the back of your mind. And then what they do what they're gonna do if this happens, what they're gonna do if that happens. I guess their their goal will be uh, to save my life. Yes, that is their goal. Well, first of all, the first goal is improve the quality of life what I have now. Yes, that, that's the main goal. And if shit uh, shit hits the fan, then then we go to bare minimum and keep me alive. I guess. Well, if shit hits the fan, they're gonna have emergency teams on standby. I hope so. They will. Trust me, they will. And they're going to want to uh, know your um, your insurance, you know, so that they can do the proper billing. Stuff that's already on the chart. All right. All right. I I'm not calm. I, I guess it's visible on me. I'm not calm, but it's fine. No, you're not calm. It's fine. And I'm trying my and best I, to calm you down, but everything I, you I'm can't, you, you can't. is not working right. But it's it's not something that uh, it's easy to get over. No, it's not. It's not. I mean, I've never had, you know, my chest cavity opened or repaired a broken bone. But I can understand. What uh, that, that's the thing. Nothing is, nothing is uh, broken. It's just in the wrong position, and yeah. that's why it's a quality of life uh, operation, because it's causing me pain and uh, and discomfort, great discomfort. But as you know, I am here for you anytime. I know I'm not physically there, hey, but Daniel. if you need me, you know, call me. I don't care if I'm at work. Uh, I, I'm not gonna call you. Why Why would I call you? Just to make you nervous. Why? No, I'm not gonna call you. Well, there will be Rita. She will be my, my uh, contact person. If you need and if anything happening with me, I, I either way, I wouldn't be able to communicate with anyone. I, I will send a message to Rita. Okay, not okay. What happened? Or I'm not sending anything because I'm already under uh, one meter ground. I don't know. I'm not saying she, surgery, uh, but between now and surgery, if you need someone to talk to, hit me up. Oh, okay, okay. I, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that, and I will tell you why. Because I will not not capable to 
make even one proper sentence because of the pain. At least they said it will be so bad. I just don't believe them. I'm not talking about the surgery part. I'm talking about between now and the surgery. All right, all right, all right. I will find you. I mean, trust you know, me. We we talk every day. You know, I'm here for you. Yeah. If Discord need, is always open. If you need, just like after your stream is done, go, hey, Daniel or Gothic, whatever you want to call me. Can we talk in private? I know you're streaming. I go, okay, give me five seconds. I'm going to shut the stream down and we can talk. No, I will never, never ask that from you or from anyone. Anyway, thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you for your care. And I will finish my stream and today. I will raid T-Tiger, she's a cat mom and she is also a moderator at uh, Bucket Puncher. I have I have people on my list, like I want to raid everybody once at I least. I know, I know. <laughs> I, have too, I have too many people on my list already. I I want, I, I was thinking to raid uh, the person who Miss Unix has uh, were raiding, but I just don't know him. Right. I, and I gotta do I was my not vibing. That basically, the person she was raiding uh, is from her branch uh, when she was playing Halo, and I'm just not sharing the same um, memories with them, so I, I couldn't connect. Yeah, that's understandable. So let me start the raid. Is it final? And let uh, me say to you, Guten Nacht, Fräulein Cynthia Hartwigsen und Schlacht good. How do you, uh, do you doing something with your language learning things? Trying to, yes. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. In that case, Guten Nacht, Herr Daniel Goetz. Okay, um, three viewers are ready to raid. People who that's speak good. German to me, so I'm trying to... Oh, that's good, that's yeah. good, that's good. Bye, everyone! Bye-bye. Okay, let me hear... Loading. Playing. Oh, Daniel, I leave you. Oh, one second, one second before you do that. And I yeah. have been like watching German movies without subtitles. Then I go back after I translate it in my head to see if I was right and I'm about 85% oh that's cool so sleep well my friend I'm gonna do some training here shortly so have a good night my friend good night bye, bye. Have to ra rank up in okay, let me just complete this part of the mission. I've been through worse. Oh. I'll board the airship. Mm, no. I'm gonna do some training. But before I do training, I have got to go use the bathroom. So I'll be right back.
to go. The next 20 seconds are circles. exercise to build our muscle endurance. Exhale when you go back to the starting position. Half the time. Stretched leg until you feel the stretch in your inner thigh. Three, two, one. Take a rest. The next 30 seconds. Side step jacks. Three, two, one. Start. shouldn't be straight when you raise them above your head. Exercise targets your deltoids. Three, two, one. Take a rest. The next 30 seconds. Standing side bend. Exercise works your obliques. Half the time. Three, two, one. Take a rest. The next 20 seconds. Adductor stretch and standing. stretching side to increase the stretch. squeezing.
16. Cynthia, I'll try that. Oof, that hurt. Three, two, one, start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You should ten, feel your abdominals 11, burning. 12, Maybe 13, even shiver. 14, 15. Upper body forward. 
Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. as straight as you can. Half the time. Three, two, one. Take a rest. The next 20 Russian twist. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Take a rest. The next thirty seconds. Hold your stretch. Twenty two seconds at time.
Okay, ladies and gentlemen. That is it for the stream. Everybody have a good evening. And we'll see you tomorrow.